Hello everybody, how are you doing? This is Eric and Octavius with Mountain Moves. Today we are working on the railroad all day long. No, I'm just, I'm just kidding. We are redoing this retaining wall because it was beginning to fall down. Uh, so we're gonna put some sleepers in here. And some cross ties. And so the most important deal here is just to make sure that everything stays in place instead of you can see how it slowly started to fall over from the weight behind. So what we have done differently is instead of just stacking them up on top of each other, we're putting in these going to help the wall uh, not be able to fall forward as it has been because it's going to create weight back here, kind of anchor it into place. So it won't be a problem with that in the future. All right, here we are. Got the top completely tied in. <clears throat> all the rebar is driven. Uh, we got all the old ties out. All this stuff was just falling apart. So it wouldn't have been long and this whole wall would have just caved in on itself. Not only was it not built as well as it otherwise could have been, uh, but the structure itself was just coming down. So this time, we're going to keep at it, get this thing leveled out. Just cutting these uh, railroad ties. Make sure you got some face protection. Man, there's all kind of chemicals in here that you don't want on your body. Definitely not in your lungs. So, be safe. This here is our supervisor. This is the uh, vice president of sales here at Railroad Inc. It looks very pretty, if I do say so myself. Before they had some jagged, non-consistent steps, we're gonna take care of that. These are gonna be comfortable, consistent steps. All right, guys, we got the last uh, row back here removed. Put this next row right in front of that. And this thing, man, it's not going nowhere. Big guy, little shovel. <laughs> We're going to start tearing out this bottom row, putting the new ones in place, get it nice and cleaned up. As you can see, here's the inside of one of these ties. And uh, from the outside, it looks just like this. You would never know that the inside is completely throttled out. It doesn't have much left as far as structure at all. Looking good to me. We got everything laid. Now all we got to do is work on the steps. Make sure that we have a gradual step up and not a violent step up like I had on here before. Try to make this safe. When steps are inconsistent like they were, it's definitely a trip hazard. When you got some shorter, some smaller, some taller, etc. So we're just trying to get them all to be the same. So that's gonna bring it out here somewhere. I'm gonna tie it in somehow, make it look good. <sighs> we are almost done. We're one tie short of completion. We need one more tie here. One more tie here. So let's just kind of trim it in, make it look better more for visual reasons than anything but as far as structurally we are complete these things aren't light they're about 225 pounds a piece and i am very happy to not have to lift anymore <laughs> it looks good
I make sure I put that on <laughs> YouTube and we get millions of views. <laughs> we could all pause and have a moment of silence. And remember this young mallet's life. As precious as it was. All right, y'all. There it is. Man, wait till he gets some plants in there. Can y'all imagine that? How awesome that's going to look when he's got some flowering plants and some shrubs in there. So thank you again for following along with us. This is Eric with Mount Movers. You need something done similar to this. If you got some landscape, labor, general labor, painting, handyman services. If you're in the middle of Tennessee area, call Eric with Mount Movers. We'll make it happen. Thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next one.